ears is unhinged. I can already tell. You're going. I don't know what you're talking about. I, I don't know look, what you're talking about. We're it's, taking a look at your pile right now. And we're mine, just like, mine is um. There, there is an interactive portion of mine. Okay, so I'll go last. Interactive. Okay. That's fine. I'll go last. Welcome to Cult Cinema Catacombs, folks. Uh, we are in uh, episode two. Oh my! Oh, he's There's got a, a fucking, picture. He's got oh, a fucking God. gallon picture. You said I wasn't sure. I'm not sure how um, I'm gonna get water downstairs to the to the office. And I thought you meant just like I don't I don't know what I thought you meant, but not this. He's what are doing, we doing the old school Gen X drinking from the hose is what he's what doing. What are we What are we doing right now? Let's well, go. Is, what do you want? This, this is you want uh, this onion soup mix? <laughs> Jesus! Oh no! Oh, no! This is episode two of up. Lillard Fair. This is Lillard. This is Lillard Fair episode two. But prior to that, this month we're also doing some TikTok challenges. And mm-hmm. um, guys, you need to see the video so you could just see Andy just straight shooting a Chinese takeout packet of soy sauce that he just did. You're in my house now. (laughs) And just so you can see, you think I'm locked up in here with you, Roy, you're locked up in here with me. (laughs) So for those who don't think I have to go first, (laughs) mine is the most tame. (laughs) So for those who don't know, the water challenge is basically people who have like taken a bunch of drink mixes Mm -hmm. and created flavors that shouldn't be normal drinking water. Like someone created banana nut bread. Yeah, we saw the tang earlier. We were like, oh God. <laughs> this is the so, one with the measuring spoon in it. Okay. We've got two more out there if you need them. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and we're going to see if we can create a new flavor with our mixes. Um, Courtney, we're gonna let you go first. Since you said okay. you've got the tamest, we're gonna let Andy go last because his I- looks the most involved. Yeah, I think mine, based on what's happening around me, tells me that it's probably the most tame. So I just went to the Mio section and just got a bunch of Mios. We buy them a lot because my kid likes them more than juice. So I have a blueberry lemonade flavor Okay. that I'm going to squirt in. And I tested this, and I know it's right, and that's what's weird. I I didn't plan it like this. So there's some blueberry lemonade. There's some Arctic grape that I'm throwing in as well. You know, I love the fact that, you know, when you think of the Arctic, you think grape. You think of grapes, don't you? I do. Mm -hmm. Um, And then this Mio Energy, which I did not realize I bought the energy drink version. Oh, caffeine boost. There you go. I I, Yes. I bought bought mine because I know that how we record and I figured at some point an hour and a half from now, we were going to need that energy that we get. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. but anyway, this one has to be stored in a different place because the absolute last thing that Dot Diana Robertson needs on this planet <laughs> is an energy Damn drink. Me. And so I'm squirting some of this. This is a this flavor is Wicked Blue Citrus, Ooh. the one color that citrus isn't. Uh, <laughs> right, there's no citrus. <laughs> it's the one, the one color that citrus doesn't come in. Uh, and so I've mixed these flavors together, and I tested it earlier, and I went, hang on, because I'm tasting it here. Yeah, no, that still checks out. What I've done is I've made uh, Mio Fruit Punch. Nice. <laughs> <It's the same. laughs> nice. <laughs> if you just have Mio Fruit Punch. Good job. So, Good job. Way to take this really seriously. So I, I appreciate really that about you. So I'm just going to squirt some of this in there, too, so I can have more Fruit Punch per Fruit Punch. Oh, hey. Also, yeah. it, it looks reminds like me. Now it looks you like ever get a cocktail from that you get yes <laughs> Joe's Crab Shack? That's what I was just about to say. Anybody ever have a cocktail at Joe's Crab Shack? Because that's what I just did. <sighs> Heck yeah, double fruit punch, man. Yeah, it's right, fruit punch I'll squared. Go. I'll go. So next. that's mine. Viola. So, so, so my ingredients are inside the skull head that's going oh no right now from the Dollar Tree. Uh, I saw this thing and I was like, I have to have this. Uh, and one of my flavors I got from the Dollar Tree, so that's so, oh. you a know, benchmark of quality there. So God help us all. So I've got my glass right here. So what I'm adding to the glass first is a shot of great value peach tea. So we got a shot okay. of that. Next, we've got a shot of great value Arctic Frost electrolytes. Not to be confused with my Arctic grape. No. Yeah. Oh, it's Arctic electrolytes. General, general frost. 
Next, we've got the Mio Fruit Punch. Hey! Hey, we're all over that. We did it! And then, to get a little spicy with it, I'm going to put in some of this uh, powdered A&W root beer flavored nice. drink. Not all of it, because that's a lot of aspartame. Oh, I love <laughs> it the oh, into the air. I like it just wafted there. I love it. That's like a Batman smoke bomb. <laughs> <laughs> and then for the quality, I'm going to ruin a can of liquid death sparkling water with this concoction. Yeah, I did not waste any of my good water with this. I don't have any good it, plain it. water. All right. So first yeah, I guess all, we can so say I, that for this monstrosity. Look at this. <laughs> it's like it's like coagulated blood color, basically. It's, it's something, is what that is. Oh. Oh. Yours looks like soda. Yeah, yours looks like uh, Dr. Pepper straight from but the teat. But what you guys probably can't see is straight that the Straight from the teat. Is that the A&W root beer powder is coagulating on the sides. That's got me scared. Did you bring anything to mix it with? Uh, yeah, a chopstick. Okay. Disposable, I hope. No. This is these are my acrylic. <laughs> these are my good ones. These are the good oh, boys. No, God. <laughs> these are my hot boys. <laughs> I'll up in those plastics. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. Just slapping it around in there. Yeah, here we go. Die bolgia. Die something. <laughs> it's the drink that makes you Scorsese. <laughs> it woke him up. Yeah. You know what I made, actually? Hard to tell him. Okay. You know the candy spree? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Imagine taking a handful of sprees and just shoving them in your mouth and biting down. Same effect. Okay. So I've Chalky and unpleasant. <laughs> yes. So I've created spree the soda. All right. I feel... Not insane at all. I feel I feel like I did this wrong. I think I'm, I'm not hurting. I'm not well, upset. You, oh, but it's getting Courtney, sour. Oh, you, you oh. are you are the closest thing that we have to a chef in real life. You you're going to take the flavor profile seriously, which is <laughs> I why I'm relying. To taste that. Which is why I'm relying on you for my part of this. Oh, oh my God. God! The more I drink it, the more sour it gets. What the I don't heck? want root beer to taste sour. That sounds bad. That sounds yeah. very bad. Oh, okay. That, no. Okay, your turn, Mr. Farmer. He has four glasses here. I'm only I don't know. Three. Are you here? Are you at my house? Do you have these I don't glasses? Know no, but I just am concerned that there's enough for everyone. Oh no! I'm going to have all of these. But what's going to happen is out of this, you're going to each choose up to three flavors that I'm going to put in here and drink. Mm. Oh. This is interesting. Okay. And now I'm gonna we're playing a game. Own. I'm going to make my own, too. So I'm going to go over the flavors. I've got Tang. Good old-fashioned good old fashioned Tang. Okay. I've got Mio Black Cherry. Black cherry and bramble lamb. I've got fruit punch. Great okay. value fruit punch. Mm -hmm. I've got great value grape. Okay. I have milk magic strawberry <laughs> little granules. I've also got milk magic chocolate. Little Are granules. those those drinkable straws? Yeah, you put them in, you mix them up, and it it's like yeah. uh, Nesquik. Okay. I have Lipton onion soup mix. <laughs> I have beef better than bouillon paste. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll go ahead and I'll throw the tagine in there. It's sure, for another challenge, not? but why not? Um, so, Courtney, let's start with you. You can have up to three of these ingredients. Or I'm going to mix them up in a glass and like drink the it. melting face from Poltergeist right now. <laughs> Because <laughs> that's what my soul is doing. <laughs> okay. Um, 
All right. So tell me, do you want do you want sweet or do you want savory? Dealer's choice, baby. Uh, you do your thing. Okay. Okay. I think the better than bouillon is going to take a long time to dissolve, and you're going to have to drink this sooner rather than later. Well, I'm going to wait till I build all of them. Oh, in. oh, okay, 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 okay. So here's what I want. Okay. I want you to do. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going savory, but okay. not in a hopefully not in an unpleasant way. <laughs> Trying right. not to harm you. <laughs> all right. So uh, give me a little of that bouillon. Sure. Let me put some water in first up the bowl. Yeah, it's probably a good idea so it can See, get, get to dissolve it. All of my kitchen implements came out of that video we watched. I was about um, to say, yeah. Are we making You mean that modern video with the scratchy old film filter on top yeah. of it? Are we making a mock uh, a, a mock chicken salad sandwich drink, drink? here? God, yes, that'd be good. Yeah, this is all start right. with beef bouillon. Mm, it's good. It's good. Mm. Not I mean, not a lot. Just like no, yeah, no. like that's plenty. Yeah. yeah, it's not. It's better than bouillon. You don't need that much. You, you should have went to like a British store and got some Vegemite or, or like World Market. Marmite. Yeah, got some Marmite. Go to the weird, the weird aisle in my Kroger that has like tahini and jelly babies and Marmite and yeah. borscht. <laughs> Oh God, borscht! Flavor. Get that oh. off of there! And, and, uh, oh, get that yeah, off of there! there Drop in there like a mm. bowl. I love mm. it. Okay. Mm. And now, what I'm going to have you do here is add some of the onion soup mix. <laughs> All right. Say I have a plan. I have a plan. I don't You're know building. if it's going to work, but I have a plan. You're I'm building, building flavor. <laughs> I'm building, building flavor. <laughs> I'm layering. Super simple. So delicious. All right. How much do you want me to put? Is that uh, enough? I think oh, that, that, that's probably good. Yeah, that's, that's a good. lot that's a of sodium mix. right there, boy. You're going to get your feel like I'm, I feel like I'm at all caught. Can somebody FaceTime Jason? <laughs> yeah, where's Jason? Oh, that smells delicious. <laughs> Shout out to Jason the X. Um, My partner in crime and eating just the most awful whatever i can find okay so there's that and so this one's gonna sound like a wild card and it's gonna sound like i'm trying to harm you let's but go I'm not uh these last two uh just a little tap of the tahini okay just a little tap of it. can somebody give me a good solid grip it and rip it yeah yeah grip it and rip it baby <laughs> Gra grab it and <laughs> is it sealed no okay yeah that should be plenty okay and now I want you to mix it up with that chocolate milk magic. I'm going for a chili. I'm going for chili. <laughs> going for, going you're going for chili. Cincinnati chili, the drink. <laughs> hey, Roy. Yeah? Buddy, when you said let's do this, is that what, is this what you imagined it would be? Honestly, yes. I was hoping for this. Uh, <laughs> I was hoping for something Did you like remember this. that our friend Andrew is an absolute chaos goblin? <laughs> Yes. I'm a bad, bad man. How do you open this? That I can't help with. I've never... Did you need something to cut it open? <laughs> need office supplies for this? <laughs> Jesus. All right. Hold on. I think this is going great. I don't think it's upsetting. <laughs> I'm glad that this is riveting radio right here for uh, those who are listening oh, and not Lord. watching the video because, yeah. Oh, there he goes. He's pouring. He's pouring. He's pouring. Okay. I'm afraid of, I'm afraid the milk magic's gonna have too much sugar. All right. Did I make something that tastes like anything? <laughs> That's the game. That's the game we're playing. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay, that one is that one I, is the, the oh. chunks of the it's, onion. Yeah, it's the floating. onion soup that's really not great. Uh, it's really that's uh, up right now. So it's visceral. Oh my god, it's, look at that! It's really visceral. That, that I, looks like what they wow. threw up uh, when they got done swimming in the sand river. That's what it looks like. Okay, I understand if you don't want to hang out after this. <laughs> oh, I'm loving this. All right, what's number two, Roy? What do you got for me? Okay, what are your fruit? What are your fruit flavors again? So I've got I got black cherry, I've got tang, I've got fruit punch, and I've got grape. Okay, 
Uh, let's go with some grape. All right, let me get this so. sucker open. Okay, let me get the water oh, in. Oh, Andy's a professional. Didn't open all of his packages ahead of time. Wow. I didn't wow. have three days to figure all this out. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what just occurred to me? What? So I'm going to have to stir this with something, and that spoon's been up in there. Oh, just no! Doing oh, the thing. My, no! Kingdom, my kingdom for a tea towel. All right, so there's some more grape, less grape. Oh, that, the, no, that's that's fine. So, so uh, we got the grape. Okay. Uh, the tagine. <laughs> tagine's the star of the show, apparently. Yeah. Go with the tagine. How much? I'll say I'll say when. <laughs> the tahini is my fault. It was supposed to be a when? palate cleanser. Okay, there's the tagine. Okay. Uh, some more of that Limpton soup mix. <laughs> oh, Courtney is so scared. I'm upset. Not a lot of it, just a little bit. Just, you know, to... Just a little bit. Just a little bit. A whisper kiss of Limpton soup mix. Is it more of a garnish? Is it more of a garnish yes, than more a... more of a garnish at this point. This is the end of Blair Witch, and Andrew is in the corner, and I'm powerless. <laughs> And then not the chocolate, but the other flavor of the, the strawberry. The strawberry. Oh, yeah, sure. I got to get into my knife again. <laughs> I think Courtney's about to vomit. <laughs> She's crying into her boobies. <laughs> it's my shirt. Not everything's about boobs, Roy. <laughs> oh, just the way you were doing it. You were like hunched over, like, dear God, what have I done? What 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 sins have I committed in the past? I was Cleopatra and she did some shit, you guys. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so and he's back and he just smacked. I saw in everything. Face. I love it. I haven't even started drinking this shit yet. Okay, how much of this do you want? All of it. All of it, baby. All right. All so right. That's go. my that's my beverage. OK. I'll have the record show that I wanted it to be savory in a good way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want mine to be sweet and savory. Just like so I had the idea when you first said this to me. Each one looks like poop. I love it. When you it's first like, brought this up, the first thing that popped into my brain. Yeah. Literally, like, the first thing that hit my brain was these two words together. Cherry beef. So I just want to make some cherry beef for myself. Okay. Okay. Is, 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 uh, so, is cher so we got cherry beef and we got pimp scampi. Oh, I wish I would have gotten some, like, some, some, some sort of, like, shrimp, shrimp-based bullion situation. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We got the the bullion going on here. Seems like too much. All right. I love how goopy it is. Just there you go. Oh God, just fell in there like some symbiote. I mean, you you got venom in there that you're stirring around right now. God, I love how it's taking forever to dissolve. That's probably good. And I'm just going to throw some cherry in there. I think Courtney's has been sitting long enough now that it's probably a marinated. I hope yeah, it's, it's probably not viable. That bad. Probably viable. Strong. Um, just a little squirt. Strong. <laughs> Making it strong. At least yours is a different color than ours. Yeah, uh, we got a whole, we got a whole, like, like from. And it looks like running out of toner. Yeah. All right. So, Courtney, you want to start with yours? I guess. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, wow, God, that's a big gulp. Oh my God, he's it. drinking like the whole thing. Oh man. Oh God, is he going to get the There's sludge that. at the bottom? No. Okay. I'm gonna leave that. That wasn't bad. That's what I was hoping to try and get chili. Not chili. <laughs> <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say chili, but 
I would say definitely Beef Wellington. Okay. <laughs> I'll somewhere take in it. that range. Yeah, you did good. Okay. We got a you Beef got- Wellington water. Okay. I could like pre gym some Beef Wellington. Okay. All right, Roy's. Oh, God. Which is the most unhinged. Here. Yeah, it's definitely no, chaotic evil. No thought went into this. There is, what is in here, Roy? Jester. That's what's in there. There was J- grape. There's grape. We've got milk. strawberry. When we got tagine and uh, uh, lemon soup. On the top mix. There. Yeah, the tagine, tagine is just right up on top. Let me let me hit this a little bit. Get it. And now a little, the, just the tiniest kiss of, of the cherry. <laughs> cherry. Oh, that's god awful. That's the worst <laughs> thing I've ever tasted in my entire life. <laughs> oh my god, and you've had Vienna sausage water. It what tastes like, taste like it tastes like diet something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what diet something. Yeah, that's all I'm getting out of that one. Oh, oh, and that tagine that's up in there at the end <laughs> tastes like hot grape. <laughs> oh my god, hot grape! Hot, hot grape. Oh, and there's a piece of onion. There we go. Okay. Uh, All right, now mine. (laughs) Courtney's just lost control over her assumptions. All right, so cherry peach. I got some of Roy's concoction on my leg. (laughs) Is it eating away like the acid from an... Yeah, it's just boring straight through. I'm pretty sure I can use it for DEET. Um... (laughs) Not less harmful to the environment. That I actually like. I like a cherry beef. It's good. I mean, I guess cherries on beef is not insane. No. Smoke and take a brisket or whatever, but. This. I win. I created the worst one. This particular (laughs) challenge is was really tailor made for me to have a great time and Courtney to have a complete mental breakdown. Yes, yes. Oh, we'll wait until the next episode with the next food challenge. That's going to be a total breakdown for Courtney. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm trying to be kind. Apparently, I've done something. I've put something <laughs> out into the universe where I deserve this. So so what does all this have to do with uh, this month's selection for Lillard Fair match? Um, well, nothing. 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 It was like nothing that I know of. Nothing, except for the fact that, you know, it's about dancers and you should hydrate while you're dancing, I guess. I don't know. Sure. Uh, No, I like it. This is the second film that was picked for us uh, by Matthew Lillard, and he's got a supporting role in this film. And this one I'm really curious to watch because of the cast. It's, It's not only Matthew Lillard, but it's also Patrick Stewart and Carla Gugino. Um... And this film was just barely given any type of release, honestly, to be honest with you. It was, seems like it should have gotten a bigger release or yeah. at least be more talked about. Big right? names and stuff. I mean, it's got a 76% on Rotten Tomatoes and, you know, critics seem to have liked it. And the cast is amazing on this. But, yeah, it was just a little independent film for that was shown at like at the Tribeca Film Festival. And then barely released theatrically by uh, IFC films. But uh, this, like I said, this was the second one that was recommended to us. This was from a um, man who, uh, let's see, it was directed by Stephen Bieber is his name. Oh, sorry. Bell. Oh, Bell-Bur. Stephen. <laughs> I, like, I'm sorry. And I both went. What? <laughs> no, Stephen. Bell. No is this a story? Uh, <laughs> Um, some of the stuff that he has, uh, made in not only include this movie, but he's also, uh, done the, oh, he's, uh, he wrote the screen adaptation of the Laramie Project. Okay. Um, he also, or no, actually he wrote the play, the Laramie Project. Oh, Uh, Oh my gosh. I'm a bad theater person. Craig would have been like the Laramie Project guy. Yeah. So, uh, (laughs) And then he also was involved, of course, with, you know, the Laramie Project 10 years later and stuff like that. 
And <laughs> honestly, so <laughs> just, um, he also something's wrote, in my sinus cavity right now. I don't know what it is going on inside your body right now. It really, oh, yeah. it, things are reacting to other things. Polymers, <laughs> microplastics. Uh, he also wrote for a year on uh, the show's Law and Order SVU, and also the Dennis Leary show Rescue Me. Okay. So you know this guy's it's got pedigree. Some, he's got some pedigree. Work. Uh, this is based off of a Broadway show. Uh, the Broadway show uh, earned a Tony nomination for Frank Langella, uh, who's basically playing the part that Patrick Stewart is playing in this film. The play also starred Ray Liotta and Jane Addams. So he's got some pedigree under his belt. Yet this movie just really, I've never heard of this one until now. So when was it, when was it released? And I don't know the show either. Uh, let's see, this one was released, uh, Match was released in, it was at the Tribeca Film Festival in 2014 and then got a limited release in 2015. Okay. Can we blame the pandemic for it? I think we can. <laughs> it did, I mean, it feels like we can. Yeah, why not? I mean, I'm sure. I mean, Obama was still in office, but sure. Let's go ahead and blame. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Let's go ahead and blame the pandemic for this. Anything between 2015 and 2021 that didn't get the sauce that it should have, I'm just blaming it on the pandemic. That's yeah. Especially Washington since space. this is uh, this is Lillard Fair, which means there's a decent chance we're gonna really like all three of these flicks. Yeah, yeah, there's a, there's a very good chance. All right, so are we ready then to, uh, after we have uh, ruined our, our stomachs and our palates, are we ready to dive into match? There's something in my, like, eye, I feel like. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's, like, back here. It's, uh, this side is in here somewhere. It might be onion. Is it an uh, illicit parasite that came in through the French onion soup? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> It was freeze dried. This is the thing. This is the new thing. I'm making a movie oh called my The God. Thing. This is the... Oh. But Courtney <laughs> wins. Courtney wins. She got the most normal one. She made a soup. Uh, she made an actual. I like, tried. A, she made a soup that I drank cold. You made a Roy beef tried Wellington. to destroy me, and the tagine came close. The floating layer of tagine sediment. <laughs> That somehow went in first and also last. Um, I'm a chaos goblin. I mean, yeah, of course I'm going to, you know, get it in there. And then mine was just it, what I thought it was going to be. It was just beef and cherry. You were ready for it, yeah. Yeah, we I, for that's why I go cherry. to Arby's. I, and Courtney also <laughs> beef, and beef, and beef and cherry. And Courtney also wins because she managed to find a way to create Mio fruit punch by buying four <laughs> yeah. additional fruit punch <laughs> flavors. <laughs> Uh, if you fruit, mix but... together these three Mios that you bought, you can remember that you could have just bought one fucking Mio. <laughs> and then I created the aftertaste, a, 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 a soda version of the aftertaste of eating a whole package of Sprees. Yeah, you created Cocter Pepper. <laughs> yeah, Cocter Pepper. <laughs> yeah, uh, take that, TikTok. <laughs> right. I've learned that I'm a rule follower in a way that my friends are not. <laughs> I'm a brat. <laughs> you are. It's your hot brat summer. It's yeah, hot it's a hot summer. brat summer. There hot you go. Brat, brat, cherry beef. <laughs> summer. Cherry beef for Kamala. There you go. There, there can't well, be. now now it's hot brat summer. <laughs> hot brat <laughs> summer. Hot brat summer. <laughs> mm, it's better that and some gravy and onions. Uh, I'm going to go get some nitrates, and then I think I'm going to watch a match. Yeah. Did you say match or bitch? <laughs> match! The movie, the film that we're talking about. The one that we're like like doing. Oh, no. I thought you were the spree Kelly. is taking hold. I Someone thought you were, save him. I thought you were revoking Kelly from his shoes and going, batch. <laughs> I'm going to snort an entire thing of Mio Grape, and I'm going to watch this movie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gang, we'll be right back after we have watched Match. It's an inhaler now. <laughs> <laughs> 